We're gaining new insight on what's next for Purdue's football program a day after the university severed ties with head coach Daryl Hazel. His firing comes after a 9-33 overall record while at Purdue. This morning, GoldenBlack.com's Alan Karpik talked with us about this weekend's decision, the outlook for the rest of the season, and about interim coach Jared Parker, who until now was the wide receivers coach. Well, I think Jared's an interesting guy. He's going to bring some enthusiasm. He's 35 years old, and that uh, seems very young to me, but he's got, got that enthusiasm in terms of it. But he's in a very strange situation. He finds out yesterday that uh, his head coach is no longer the, the, the guy. He's running the show, so he's going to have to get up to speed quickly. But I think he'll bring some, uh, some in, not innovation, but some enthusiasm, hopefully some fire, hopefully keep this team focused as much as possible here for the remaining six games. Because that was the message yesterday, guys, that, that – uh, there's still a lot of football left to be played, and I think that's what's going to be an interesting thing to, to see how that works out. So midseason here, can they win another game? <laughs> they won't be a favorite in any other game, Dustin. We'll hit that every Friday, unfortunately. But I, 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 think, they can, I think they can. It's just going to be a, uh, a rough road. Mm. Well, they talked about really focusing on the rest of the season, but you've got to start thinking about next year and the next head coach. So... How's that going to work? Well, it, it, it's going to work because I think Mike Babinski is going to be starting on that process right now. I mean, even though he's again he's talked about being the focus of the team, focusing on the team. But you can talk to agents, you can get some gauge some interest and in some intermediaries. I think that part will will begin sooner than later, and it will be interesting to see what that what that list comes together with. But you have to believe that uh, this is the this is the most important hire in the history of Purdue football. In a lot of ways, if you're going to get this back, you've got to get this decision right. Again, that was Golden Black's uh, Alan Karpik this morning on News 18 this morning. So who could the next head coach be? That's the question. Here's Alan's short list. Some of the names floating around include P.J. Fleck, Brock Spack, and Les Miles uh, of, of LSU. But again, it's early. Alan cautioned there are so many variables at play here that it's really just too early to go there with any confidence. We'll have much more on this story tonight on News 18 at 5 and 6.